Yo, I'm back. And for today, we're going to be talking about some sneak peeks that that boy for you has finally posted. So if you guys didn't know, that boy for you decided to actually post a sneak peek because once he saw the player count for this game, he knew he had to because that shit was dropping every day. Yeah, so now he posted two pictures, two sneak peeks that we are going to be talking about. Now, I'm going to pull up both pictures right now, and you guys can give me a little spins on it. I'm actually going to say something real quick. This is not the gold gold fruit. I don't know where that started. This is not the gold gold fruit from the movie gold. This is nothing like it. If you think about it, Impel Down is coming out. On top of the fact that Foyu always tends to add fruits that align with the update, it's because it wouldn't really make any sense that the go go fruit will be coming down for an impel down update if you think about it i do i do understand why a lot of people might think like that because you know for is a random guy you can never know what he's thinking like when he added the vampire race which i'm still questioning that to this day but other than that the, i i just want to say this is not the go go fruit this is most likely going to be the buddha buddha no me he might make his own spin on the fruit, maybe probably make like a part one to it and a part two, because we do know with the Buddha Buddha fruit, the actual, like the like when you transform, you're transforming into this big, big sumo wrestler like being. So obviously when you look at the screenshot, he doesn't look big. So you know what I'm saying? You can really, this might be like a part one to it, a part two, or well, you might be doing his own little twist to the Buddha Buddha fruit. Because as you guys see, he has like a big bright aura around him. Everything he has on is golden apart from the eyes, even the hair too, even the accessories in the back, which I think this is the vampire race too. This is probably a different variant. But yeah, and then when you look at the second screenshot, this just furthers my claim that this actually is the Buddha Buddha fruit because no other fruit, not even the gold gold fruit, is gonna create a shockwave like this. We do know the Buddha Buddha fruit, it packs a punch. So this shockwave and the massive beam of light in front of it definitely symbolizes the buddha buddha fruit now i am going to hold you i'm a bit happy i'm a bit happy now for you and the developers actually let me not say the developers it's mainly for you they've been lacking pretty much um all i can really like all i really know right now is that the update should be coming out around october since they now are posting a little bit more sneak peeks hopefully maybe in a few more weeks he'll post a showcase and then with that showcase other new sneak peeks so i'm hyped for that as well but yeah i ain't gonna hold you the buddha buddha fruit looks pretty solid we we don't really know too much about him but if you guys watch the anime you should know a lot about it already but i'm only saying that's because this is the only two screenshots that he actually showed on the discord server now you guys might think oh that's it it's just the buddha fruit that's awful you gotta show us after months of no update but no the screenshot has something else if you pay close attention to the corner you see a sword. Now, you might be thinking, what sword is that? Is that Shanks' sword? Is that Zoro's sword? But no, it is Roger's sword. The reason why I know of this is because when you look at the handle, it looks exactly like the one Roger had that episode in Wano when he did that little move of his. I don't even know what that move is, but that's obviously Roger's sword. Now, it might be Shanks' sword. I might be wrong, but from what I'm seeing at with the handle, it definitely looks a lot more like Roger's sword. Now, if I was to make any speculations, maybe you have to kill a boss and then you obtain this sword, or because for you is adding another game mode, maybe this might be the prize weapon that he was talking about when he was stating information about that game mode. Now, the thing is though, the only thing I really know about Roger's weapon is that he only did that one move in the anime, so I really do not know anything about this weapon. But because of the fact that it's on the game mode and it's probably going to be the prize weapon that you get for whatever you have to do for that game mode, it's most likely going to have a lot of more. It's probably going to have more than one move, so Foley might make his own little twist to the weapon, but also adding a move that Roger did use in the anime. So I honestly can't wait. I know it's going to be busted. There's no way it's not going to be busted, to be honest with you. And from what I'm seeing, we got the vampire, we got Buddha. We got Roger's weapon, we got the game mode, we got Leopard, and to be honest with you, I feel like this probably is going to be another Devil Fruit that we are going to be getting for this update, because we do have Leopard, we do have Buddha, but I feel like Foley might add just probably like at least two to one more. The only reason why I'm speculating that is due to the fact that 
Do you feel as, as dry as sage as possible? If he wants this update to at least last, I feel like he needs to add some things. Even if he has to half as it, as long as he adds it, I feel like people will be satisfied. And yeah, that's pretty much going to be it. The update so far looks pretty solid to me. I honestly can't wait for Roger's weapon. You guys already know what it is. It's so easy!